Hey guys, it's Stefan from Tutorial Australia and today we'll be looking at iMovie and how to add picture in picture. Picture in picture is a great effect for iMovie, even though it is a simple program and is very cost worthy, it's a good effect to use for things like commentary of a video. So you're going to be opening iMovie to start. This is iMovie 11, I recently downloaded this from the App Store. It is $17.99, so it's a pretty good buy for a simple to use program. So what you want to do is take your sample video, the one that's going to be uh, behind what video you're going to put over it. So this is yesterday's, uh, actually, the tutorial I did yesterday on ScreenFlow. I'm just going to take a little bit of it here, just drag and put it over here. You can see it's got this and the background. Alright, and say you want to do a commentary over that, you saw yesterday that I just did a flatline commentary with no video. If you want to add a video commentary for this, I'm just going to add a sample of this video I did a while back for my main channel on gaming, just a vlog, just a little, uh, just to show you guys. So what you're going to do is put this over here, and you want to drag it on top. See, if this doesn't come up here, what I want you to do is click cancel, and go over to click iMovie and click preferences. And what you want to do is click show advanced tools. This will work for iMovie 09 as well. So it's not just iMovie 11, you can do picture in picture. So you want to click out of that, and if you already have advanced tools, then just select your video you're going to put on top. So I'm just going to pick this with me and my dog. So you're going to put that on top, and then this will come up. You can do picture in picture, side by side, green screen, and blue screen. But today we're working with picture in picture. I will do more tutorials on different things you can do in this program as well. But today we'll focus on this. So you want to click is picture in picture. And you say this will pop up at the top. And you've noticed already that you are sitting in the top right corner. So you want to click done and I'll just show you what happens. If you're running a slow computer or an old one, it might be degraded while you're viewing two HD videos. So, but, but by the way, when you export it, it will be all right, so don't worry. So you want to play from the start. And at this section, I pop in in the top right corner. So obviously you can make this go for longer if you select a longer clip. See, so this is around three minutes here, so this could all cover the whole thing. But for now, I'm just showing you just if you want a little bit of it. And then you can click on this, and you can actually make it bigger and you can also move it around so if you want me to be here not saying you would but if it's just a white background and it's not a computer screen you're recording depending on what you're doing you can move this box around depending where you want the commentary to be but I'm just going to keep in the corner for now and you can also double click on this to change what you want you can have effects like a border color and click on that and it will give you some borders uh, for now it's not doing it but for visible you can have drop shadows and it will happen when you are exited, it's just you, I haven't selected it yet, but you can put borders in and then there'll be a black border around this video. So basically if you have a white background and if you have like say a white video, to make it stand out a bit you can put a background in like a border colour. And you can have effects like dissolve and you can also change this video as well as the normal video, a video effect. So you can give it say hard light, romantic, heat wave, negative, stuff like this. But for now, I'm just going to keep it as normal. There, all the effects you can kind of uh, change around and fiddle with depending on what you want. You can also change some uh, saturation and contrast for that video itself. You can see it's changing in the top right corner while we speak. And you can also change the audio levels. I have it on mute at the moment, so it doesn't, again, the way of the, um, the commentary we're doing right at the moment. So you can add all these different effects for the uh, video you put on top, as well as doing the same for this video on the bottom. So you can see here, now it added a bit of little contrast to the video whilst it's on top. So hopefully enjoy that little tutorial for picture in picture. I will be doing some more tutorials on iMovie 11. Most of the tools can be used on iMovie 09 if you still have that. So yeah, leave suggestions on what you want to see. Might do some transitions or other things like uh, side by side and some other programs. It's all up to, to your suggestions and things I do myself. So hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. Leave a like, leave a comment, share it around to get me off my feet. It's only around 40 subscribers at the moment, but I'm going to be doing more videos, so stay tuned and I'll see you guys later.